Hello everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Stardew Valley. Yesterday we did a bit of fishing, we got our crops set up. Sunny day tomorrow, you hate to see it every time. Good humor. Yeah, I was thinking it might be a good day to go to the mines. Got to spawn your town, relax and hold still in the steaming hot water to replenish your energy. Yeah, we knew this already. Yeah, it might be a good day to go to the mines. Got our first iridium bar here, which is, as you can see, one of those things that has the purple around it. It's a good item. Found this recipe in the magazine and thought it sounded interesting. Strange bun. Now, I remember the strange bun being important for something, but oddly enough, I don't remember what. Isn't my other fish right there as well? I'm pretty sure my other fish is... No! Where's my other chicken? I said fish the first time as well, didn't I? Is it still in here? Yeah, sure enough, it's just chilling. Don't know why. Anyway, I'm gonna do all my chores today and then we'll get down to business. And they are watered. Cool. And I know I don't have to deal with anything that's down there until the 25th, so no need to worry about that. Blueberries will take another two days. Got our first corns though. And we do need five gold corns, so I'll actually keep both of these. Now, is regular corn one of the ones? Yes, so I actually should keep both of them. Good to know. Cool. Put away my stuff, and then we'll get ready to go straight over to the mines, because I believe there's also nothing going on today. What is it, the 15th? Sam's birthday was on the 17th, so yeah, nothing to worry about there. Put that iridium bar away. That's actually should be in here in our collections, I believe. Maybe not. I think we have to donate it before it becomes in our collection. Wait, no, it should be in minerals? No. I think we have to donate it first. But yeah, you can see Super Cucumbers. 250 on its own, which is just about more than anything else. Where's catfish? Yeah, it's more than catfish. Yeah, it's the most expensive other than the... Where is it? The crimson fish, obviously. A lot of them come close, but nothing quite meets it. It's a really good one to fish for. Cool. I'll clean up some of the other stuff, and then we'll get going. Got any fruit? Sure do. Salmonberry, cherry, blackberry. I forgot to buy the apple sapling. Oh, God. I did do that, didn't I? Yeah, I, I don't need... Here's the thing. I don't need the inventory upgrade. It's not really that important to me so i'm fine actually you know what i want to keep that you can pull out the last thing you got so might as well i don't know i feel like i won't need it but hey yeah i'm gonna go buy that apple sapling and i'm gonna plant it because i having not gotten any apples from any other source and still haven't found anything from the fruit cave yeah i, th I think we should get it now Oh. Rob? You scared me sneaking into my room like that. Ugh. So I've been playing Journey of the Prairie King for hours and I can't even beat the first level. This game is ridiculously hard. Well, either that or I'm just terrible at it. Hey, do you want to try out this level together with me? I think I might do better with your help. I have forgotten how this... Okay, move, shoot, space item. Cool. So, yeah, this is a game within the game where you have to... Apparently, I can shoot her and it's fine. Where you have to basically not get touched by zombies. Now, it's funny, there's been a little arcade machine in the saloon that we could play this game whenever we wanted. I just haven't yet because I want to wait until I'm fully prepared. Also, luckily, time does not pass. I don't know how it, if it passes for co-op, but in single player, it does not pass if you're playing this game. So don't worry about that. Uh, the hardest achievement in the entire game is, uh, is related to this mini game where you basically have to beat the entire game without losing a single life, and you lose a life if you get hit at all. And even though this may look easy, it gets 
so much harder, especially when there's enemies that you're not expecting to have certain patterns, or if you're not used to the game at all. It takes a lot. I believe I looked at it and it was like a 0.6% of people have gotten through. Oh boy, use my item for burst shot. Also, she grabbed the item that I wanted. That sucks. It doesn't matter. This is, I believe, just level one. This is all the, also the music that they used in the reveal trailer for the Stardew Valley board game, which I, I guess I haven't talked about yet. Yeah, they announced a Stardew Valley board game, which I bought the moment it came live. Yeah, it was a screen nuke. Just used it for, because why not? But, um, yeah. Stardew Valley board game just got announced. We beat the first... Okay, yeah, we're done. And they used that music. Hey, that was fun. Well, thanks, Rob. You seem to really know your way around a joystick, huh? Uh, that's the way to say it. I guess that makes sense. Well, there. That's your three-heart scene for her. It's one of the benefits of being a bartender. Oh, yeah, I asked him if... I talked to him already. Let's see. What was I doing again? Apple sapling. Do not forget. I, I know it's 4,000. It probably won't end up paying for itself at that rate, but I need it for two bundles. So what am I going to do? Just not get it? No. I need it. All right. So I'm looking at my layout that I want eventually. I believe I can put it here. It's too close to another tree. Okay, here. Too close to another tree. Here. Uh. Okay. At least it won't let you plant it where it's too close. It needs to have a lot of room if you can't tell. So, yeah. And I will actually get rid of that. Because I don't know if that'll eventually do it. But it'll take a full 28 days to grow. And then it'll produce a fruit every single day on the month of fall. So, that's nice. Every... Every fruit tree has its own month, and apples are fall. I believe oranges are spring. It, it goes along like that. You can look it up if you need to, but yeah, that's how it works. Anyway, I'm going to go a little deeper in the mines. What did I leave in here? I, I left a hot pepper cheese. Sweet peas aren't worth anything? Wow. Hmm. This is also the point where I feel like having a slingshot might actually be helpful, but... Oh well. I'll try to get to floor 100. How's that sound? Well, since we just bought our first fruit tree, I think it'd be fair to talk about how fruit trees work in this game. So, when you plant a fruit tree, it takes a full 28 days to grow, so you need to plant it a full season in advance if you want to get its maximum effect. Obviously, we didn't do that with the apple saplings, so about halfway into fall, it'll start producing apples. You can let the apples accumulate for three days, and then you'll have to shake them down if you want to get more. Oddly enough, fruit trees will not pay for themselves unless you keep them for two years. Looking at the apples specifically, it costs 4,000 gold, and each apple will sell for 100 gold. Unless you put it in a keg or a preserves jar, those aren't going to pay themselves off. However, if you leave a tree for a full year and don't cut it down, it'll then start to produce silver quality fruit and then gold quality the next year, and iridium quality the year after that. So fruit trees are the better the longer you leave them. Obviously three years is a lot to put in though, so I wouldn't even count that as part of your gain, because you probably won't play that far into the game. Oh, I didn't think it was that low. Good lord. Well, 10 floors, that was ambitious, huh? Yeah, we're starting to see the bad side. How much am I going to lose, dude? Yeah, you're lucky if you do get found by someone because you can go end up in the hospital and have to pay a fee. Well, there you go. A thousand dollars. Easy. There goes my gold bar. My 45 salmon berries. Fire quartz, purple mushroom. Literally anything that's worth any money. So I just lost two thousand dollars worth of things. That's pretty gr crappy. Not gonna lie. And my salmon berries. I cannot believe that. I... Cool. I'm still slimed. Man, yeah, getting slimed is not good. I'll tell you that much. I guess I'll bring a lot of this back since we have the inventory space. 
I, I'm not carrying any stone, really. I guess the fiber can stay. Uh, the rest I really don't care about. Yeah, I guess that's showing how much I still need to do. It's It sucks that we have such a low combat level. I guess I should go back to some of the earlier... I think we gained a mining level here, but... I think we should go back to some of the earlier places and just get copper anyway. Because I don't specifically need gold right now. 225 for all the salmon berries. And the purple mushroom too. Two of them though. I can't believe that, dude. This is so bad. It would have been better if I had only gotten one purple mushroom too. But no, since I have that foraging buff, I grabbed two of them. Ah, same. I already lost so much money. That's just a shame. My inventory is full. What do you mean my inventory is full? It's not like I would have gotten them then and there. Well, how about that, huh? I mean, at least we got five floors deeper, but now I'm realized you're kidding. The one time I found grapes, the clay can go. Yo, what's poppin'? I bet guinea pig David, he just hates this hot weather. He's fussy. Cool. Good to know. Well, uh, cheese! The foraging has come out. What is a wonderful substance? It's versatile, cheap, strong? Yeah. Please be the same level of grape. It's not. You hate to see it. Uh, slime can go. Also, I got a crab from beating one of those things, so that was fun. I really don't need spice berries. I can get it later if I need. Uh, anything special in here? I'm pretty sure we've already given away one of those, so I don't need to worry about that. Well, that was fun, wasn't it? <laughs> it wasn't that a fun little experience. So I guess that begs the question what to do for the rest of the day. I guess, let's see, it's a Monday. I could go back and grab some loved items or at least liked items and see if I can't give away a few. I'm realizing now that I should have kept one of those blueberries for the summer forging or the summer crops bundle. I forgot that that was actually for the summer crops bundle, so unfortunate, but hey, we're going to be getting a literally ridiculous amount of blueberries every three days, so I'm not too worried about it. Uh, funnily enough, there's not really much that I want to sell here. Okay, we'll just start ordering things. I got seven coal, which is good. We will need that. In fact, while we're at it... Yeah, we'll do all that. There's a short amount of time that I have left that I'll be able to buy some more melons. And that's actually, I think the deadline is today to buy some more melons for the end of summer if I want to do it. I think I might have to. I think that would be beneficial to us to get just a few more just before the... Well... Is the shop still open? Because that's what's going to decide that. I'll go over now and see if it's open. If not, yeah, sucks to suck. Actually, I can just check the map to make sure. Nope. Closed at 5. Well, I think we can still get them tomorrow if we need be, but... As it is now, we just need to hope that we get 5 gold ones. Otherwise, we're going to have to rely on the on the pumpkins, which isn't too big of a deal, I suppose. So I have three grapes. One, two, three, one, two, three. Wait, did I have any grapes in there or is that all blackberries? It's all blackberries. Make those into summer seeds because those will at least make up some of the money that we lost, I suppose. It is so sad, it really is. Crab can go here. I mean, I can just donate it just for the for the lols, really. Man, I'm always so flustered every time that that happens because I'm like, well, what do I even do now? I don't even have salmon berries if I wanted to get more. I think I'm just going to end off the day. See how much money we end up with tomorrow and I'll decide what to do based on that. Do I have anything that I don't really need that I can eat? Not really. 
I want to save the parsnips for gifts. I could eat an egg and just go fishing for the rest of the day. Yeah, you know what? Sure, that's the plan. Yeah, we'll call it there. Got a few things to put in the trash, though. I'd always appreciate more cloth if we could ever get it. We seem to be getting torches pretty commonly, so... That'll be down to that. I should start remembering to bring Leah the driftwood, because I don't want to... Oh, no! I, I think I need to make another... Okay, this will be a fun little project to end off the day. Make another chest. And this is going to be... I don't really go through that. Four gems, and we'll make it purple. How's that sound? So, topaz, emerald... I don't think solar essence would really count. Ruby... Fire Quartz, Frozen Tears. I don't know why Sap is there. It should be in the other thing. Forest Sword really can go now. Is that all the... I think I'll crown or Earth Crystals as well. Jade. Amethyst. There we go. And all of those can go in here. Also known as the Emily Gifts. The box of Emily Gifts. How about that? Bada boom, bada bing. All done. Sweet. Well, what a day. <laughs> yeah, I, I'm gonna either have to get that combat level up or get better equipment. Level 6 mining, though, and we can now make bombs that we've actually been picking up through the mines anyway. Wait, crab's worth... Oh, it's just 100. Oh, yeah, the halibut is what got me the money. Other. Oh, yeah, the seeds. I did forget. Yeah, the summer seeds aren't worth nearly as much just because you only need three things to put into them as the spring seeds. What's the weather looking like? Beautiful sunny day. Looks like we're not going to get any more batteries soon. Spirits are displeased, as they always are. Oh yeah, weren't the spirits displeased yesterday as well? That would make sense. What were these? Wild plums. Yeah, we could just go ahead and sell those. We got more tomatoes. That's nice at least. And these melons are up. Uh, that's three more gold ones, so actually I think we'll be fine on that end. Wait, what else did we just get? I could have sworn I just picked something else up. Oh well. Found your last item. Yay, my salmon berries. I need them. Then we got those. Okay. Sweet. Well, I think... Here's what I'll do. I'm gonna put in these two here, because those are probably the most profitable ones we could get. Sell the rest except for the gold one. Uh, yeah, sell the gold tomato, wild plum jelly. It's Tuesday. I should be selling these actually physically so I can get up to 10,000 today. Because I... Ugh. There's many things I could be doing at 10,000. That's for sure. Save hops, I suppose. Yeah, I really should have sold those at the actual store. I can't sell the wild plums at the store anyway. Well, oops. Yeah. A lot of people say that a lot, like, hey, why are you putting them in the box when you can sell them at the store? Normally, I don't care to get the money on the same day, but it's when when we could be breaking 10000 to get a good thing today. That's when I do care. And I think what I would go for next would be... I don't know, probably actually the house upgrade. Now that we have the sashimi recipe, that could actually get us, net us a ton of money. Because what you can do with that is since it only requires fish, is you could, any fish that costs less than the sashimi does, just turn it into sashimi and then you can sell it for slightly more. I don't think that would actually affect us too much due to the fact that we're catching a lot of gold and iridium quality fish. And it'd have to be a pretty Bad. fish to sell for less than sashimi at that point as a gold or iridium quality one. Anyway, I guess I talked through all my morning chores, so we're done with that. The Interestingly enough, it doesn't seem like the grass is growing any closer, and I think it's because the chickens are keeping at, it at bay. Well, huh. I think today could just be like a go out and give gifts day and then go fishing. 
because I would like to get that money up a bit. Where did I get these three amethysts? Did I forget to put them in? I must have. And then the coffee as well. Place five beans in a keg to make coffee. Yeah, you can see that we can only make 10 coffees even with all of that coffee, so. It does take quite a bit. So hopefully we'll be getting enough to properly do that. What's, uh, how much coal do we have right now? Three? Yeah, I just don't see much of a reason to make too many more iron bars. I mean, we could actually upgrade, like, the watering can. Which would allow us to make some more crops. Well, easily. Water them easier, but, uh, I don't know. I don't know how I feel about that at this point when I'm trying to get a lot more. I'm trying to get my sprinklers growing. And we did hit level 6 farming. Actually, that's really good. So, in that case, what do we got? 12 iron. Okay. I'm going to smelt my quartz. Just so we can get as many of those quality sprinklers as I can. This is all hanging on to the fact that I hope that we get them at level 6, because that's the level that I remember getting them at. I don't know where I'm going. Sometimes I just automatically walk downwards. Uh, you know what we could get actually right now? We could just start working on a barn. I Yeah, you know what? I think we should do that. Gonna take a topaz, frozen tear, fire quartz for Clint. What are some other things that we have that people would like? Joja Cola for Sam. Now that we have two hearts with him, we'll be able to go in there. Man, I cannot believe that we lost those two purple mushrooms. Those are worth quite a bit, too. Um, I would have thought that the... Oh, what's it called started today? The picking the things... Maybe not. Oh no, you know what? It was fall. It wasn't actually summer. Now that I think about it. Bring a hot pepper. Because why not? We have so many peppers actually. I might as well bring one for Shane as well. Uh, Corn can be a good... Now, corn is a fall crop bundle. We confirmed this. Yes. I think I'm going to save the corn for now. Because we will need five gold ones. In fact, I could plant more corn, actually, if I want to go and buy some today. I don't know if coffee beans are particularly well-liked, so I'm not going to bother with that. Yeah, I think I'll buy some more corn. Just because we will need as much corn as possible, and yeah, why not, you know? Jody, Jody, Jody. Uh, I don't have anything specifically for you, but you like sweet peas. You do, you love to see it. Emily, before I miss you, I got a topaz for you. Good stuff. Like I said, it's important to work on these friendships early, because the more gifts that you get in the mail, the better. I don't think I even have anything for you. My nephew's... Nephew loves beer. It's his favorite. Oh yeah, sometimes you do get hints as to what things people like. You probably like salmon berries, right? Uh, no. <laughs> no, you don't. Sam's probably still in his room. Do not eat Sam salmon berry. Oh. Who who's playing the drums? Oh, hi Rob. Sebastian and I were just having a little jam session. We're trying to start a band, but we still don't know what kind of music we want to make. There's too many possibilities. Say, Rob, what kind of music do you like? Honky tonky country music. Uh, let's do high energy dance music. I mean, I'll, I'll be honest, out of all of these, I like cheerful pop the most. Hey, you know what? That's exactly the kind of style I've been thinking about for the band. What do you say, Sebastian? Should we do this? Okay. 
Thanks for the help, Rob. With my guitar skills and Sebastian's wizardry on the synthesizer, we're going, going to be a screaming success. I'm convinced of it. Now I just need to find someone to play drums. I don't know, your last song seemed to have drums going, didn't it? Also, your doors just automatically open. Well, have a Joja Cola. He's busy practicing guitar, which again, doesn't give you that much uh, friendship if it says it. Also, ta doing that scene, I think, cut out the music. That was funny. Well, I wish Sebastian was actually still there, because I could have just given him the frozen tear on the fly. Lewis, I know I've been, str like, struggling with you, but here's a gold hot pepper. Don't you love to see it? How did I become mayor in the first place? It's a long story. We're both too busy for stories right now. Well, are we, though? Got four hearts with him, though, so that's a decent amount. I ought to try going into some people's houses a bit to try and, like, see if it activates anything. Oh, man, I did bring the fire quartz for Clint. But I realize that we could just... Don't... I have more fire quartz. I'm going to remember to eventually bring the fire quartz to the museum because I'm going to completely fill it out. But for now, just give it to him. You want me to upgrade your tools? You have to give me the correct ore. Yeah, I know, but hey. What's a little fire quartz between friends? Yeah, I still have the steel watering... Uh, copper trash can. I mean, I could do that. But anyway, I need more copper ore while he's making the copper trash can can i not make the use the trash can like can i not throw things away that would seem silly i had hopes and dreams like you once but look at me now well hey you know what fixes hopes and dreams a parsnip hey nat hey hey how this is really something thanks a million yeah have fun at joja have a good old time you know we've got a help wanted while we're doing things I'm looking for a pike to pickle for Jody. Well, you know what? First of all, that sounds absolutely disgusting, but I can catch a pike right here in the river. I should have brought driftwood. The other day I brought a, bought a blueberry at Pierre's. It was perfect on the bed of greens and a dash of my special vinaigrette. The sound of farming animals is great, isn't it? That was my blueberry you bought. That's something I like. Sometimes if you like bring a lot of a certain crop in, certain people will mention that they bought it from Pierre because obviously Pierre sells it back to the community at an increased price because he hates everyone. But hey, we just bring them in, don't we? There we go. That didn't take too long. Hello. Oh, I must have already talked to you. Uh, we need to find Jody again. And I believe that would be up near the fountain at the park. Well, there's Demetrius. That's not who I was looking for. Make sure to water your plants every day. Make sure to mind your own business. Oh, wait. Oh, no. I know exactly where she is. And it's an event that we have hardly witnessed because I forgot to go check it out when we saw it. Oh, yeah. It's okay. All right. We're doing this, huh? There is thick with honey and nectar. Is it now? You know, eh, forget it. <laughs> I was going to give her like a sweet pea, but I am not entirely sure she'd like it. Jody, I know you're busy, but hey, do I have the fish for you? So you saw the notice I posted? Looks perfect. Let's see, here's what I owe you. Oh yeah, a fat 300, which is a good amount for a pike. Breathe in, breathe out. Yeah, this is a girl workout day. Marnie smiles at you through a mist of sweat. Exercising can be fun. Six hearts with you. Jeez, I didn't know that. Don't look, I'm all red and sweaty. Okay. My arms are getting strong. My arms are strong, but my legs need work. Fun. Yeah. Every Tuesday, one to four, it's party time. Do you like sweet peas? Yeah. That's what I thought. Uh, I guess all that's left is Sebastian and Shane. And Abigail likes sweet peas too. I I guess she'll just eat wild sweet peas. I don't know. Spice berry for Linus. Great gift. Have you come to ridicule me? Hold on. We're three hearts. And you think I'm going to ridicule you? Like that's enough for most people to let me into their room. Come on now. 
Oh, hey. Oh, hey. Give me one sec. Okay, sorry about that. I just need to finish what I was working on. What are you working on? I do freelance work as a programmer. That was an instant message from Sam. Guess he wants to hang out. Didn't y'all already hang out like an hour ago? Ugh, I just really don't feel like going out today. You were already out. Oh, hi, Rob. Sebby. Sebby. I know you don't like it when I come in here, but I ran into Abigail at the store and she said she was looking for you. Did you tell her I'm working? I did, but she said she'd probably stop by anyway. Ah, no one takes my job seriously. No one even ever bothers Maru when she's working at the clinic. Does everyone think I'm just surfing the web all day? Mm. Well, you seem career-minded. I'm going to go with the safe option here. Well, I'm trying to save up so I can move out of here. Probably to the city or something. You know, if I'd gone to college, I'd probably be making six figures right now. But I just don't want to be part of that corporate rat race, you know? Well, and I guess I'd feel more comfortable hidden behind the computer than dealing with people face to face. Well, I should get back to work. I need to get this module finished by tomorrow. Hmm. Well, that sure is something, but hey. How would you like Frozen Tear? Looking forward to see to the cold, damp season. I feel more at home. Sweet. Uh, how many hearts? Did we oh, we can check out your room. Graphic novel. Oh, can I? I forgot that you could sit on things. That worried me for a minute. Solarian Chronicles, the game. Ooh, this boy's got board games. Radio isn't plugged in. I will sit. No, I'll leave. That would be really weird. I'm gone. Don't worry about it. Yeah, it seems like the little cutscenes make the scenes go a little wonky. Uh, last thing I brought was for Shane, but honestly, he's kind of ahead of the curve right now. But he does kind of hate us because I dug through the trash right in front of his face. Do you like sweet peas? Sure enough, you do. Sebastian never... Uh, Hardly ever talks to me. wonder if he even likes me at all. He's just working. We, we went over that. But yeah, you can see why I should start trying to go into people's rooms. Because you never know where a certain cutscene takes place. So trying to check out all the places you can will help out. That's for sure. I'd be surprised if there wasn't one in here, to be honest. Nope, nothing. But hey, all reliable. No, don't. Not right in front of his head. Oh, wow, Rob. How'd you know this was my favorite? Well, because we've given it to you like 20 times. Life isn't so bad. At least I have frozen pizza and eggs. Yeah, you know, things that normal people say. Anyway, this is Journey of the Prairie King, if you're wondering. Not gonna do it yet. I'll leave that for its own thing later on. Didn't I? I already gave her the parsnip, so we're good there. Ooh, you know what? Before we go, I'm gonna see. Gus probably likes spice berries, right? That's sweet, thank you. I, that sounds neutral. That sounds extremely neutral. Or like, could be either really. You got anything for me? Salmon dinner, eh, not really anything special. I could start going for some of the recipes soon since I do want to make uh, the, what was I gonna buy? Wasn't I gonna get something? Oh yeah, I was gonna check and see if I could get a barn. I'm really bad at keeping things in mind. Like, I've been doing a little bit better with it recently, but you live next to the ocean, and I'm pretty sure you probably hate fish. I'd be surprised if Elliot wasn't our last person to get full up with. 
And Penny doesn't like salmon berries. You love to see it. You really do. Well, that was a good day of gift giving. Uh, everything's looking pretty snazzy so far. The, the gifts are pretty evenly distributed. It's always the same few people, but it's always because they're the hardest to find. Like, note that it's also, like, generally people that don't live in town. Other than, like, Harvey and them, but... Harvey, I honestly just always forget to go check out because he's in the hospital, and... I'm always like, oh, can't go in the hospital. Do we have, a uh, Two Hearts with Leah? I should check this, because she's really hard to get a, get a hold of. Yeah, we do. Okay. So we'll be able to bring her Driftwood on command at this point, basically. Which is good. Yeah, I guess I'll save 10,000. And there's just so many things that we could get. I know we'll have enough money for it tomorrow, too. So I need to decide what to do real quick. Because the barn would be nice as well. It's good to get started on that as early as you can. I don't know. Hey, we got all of our refined quartz. So we'll be able to make all of those tomorrow. In fact, you know what? I'll get my... We have seven? Okay. Because the recipe for it is refined quartz, iron, and gold, which is more than worth it for me because we just have so much iron and gold that we're really not going to have anything to do for them for a while. Blueberry jelly, hot pepper jelly, rainbow, sweet pea. Um, I will... I probably should have saved a few melons for those spots, huh? In the casks. We're gonna get more. Right? We'll be fine. Yeah. They're just such... It's such a difference in the amount of money that you get. It's double your normal melons, so it's like more than double. So it's worth it in my eyes. Anyway, that'll do it for today. I'll see you all tomorrow when we... I, I want to say go into the mines, but I don't have too much confidence with that anymore, do I? We're going to be spending some money. How's that sound? See you all then, and goodbye.